Hello everybody and welcome to Romanceville's Tarot. I'm about to begin here with a reading. Now this reading here is for the sign of Aquarius. Now this is a general reading. It's not going to resonate with everybody so please do take what fits with you and leave the rest aside. If it doesn't feel like it fits for you, you know it just doesn't. Um, if however you would like to have a personal reading, so a reading that is a hundred percent about you. It's your questions, it's you know your feelings, it's your situation please do contact me at romancefultarot at gmail.com and it'll be my great pleasure to send you um, some information out on the different types of readings that I can do for you. Also, if you have been viewing my channel or if you're new to my channel and you do enjoy the messages and you have not yet subscribed, please do subscribe. So with no further ado, I'm going to stop talking about myself. We're going to talk about you. We're going to check out this Chicoli Oracle followed, uh, not the Oracle Tarot, followed by the Oracle of Vision. So um, the, what we're looking for here tonight, I have not even told you, is what is going on in their heads. So will they cheat again? This is what we want to know. Will they cheat again? So over here, okay, I have the three of wands, I have the one or the ace of coins, and I have the five of wands. So if we're going to look at this over cap here quite uh, quite quickly here quite well, um, I do see over here that there is, um, there's material concerns over here, okay, with this card. Um, this is, um, what was only imagined before now is just manifesting itself. There's new projects, there's possibilities emerging. It's taken advantage of this prosper, prosperous time, okay? There's gift, there's opportunities, there's potential for success. You know, um, this card here represents, it's actually a bird here with a bird coming out. She's actually pregnant, okay? And uh, this is a creative moment and it's ready to apply to whatever it is that you want it to. So this is your creativity. This is the creativity that you're going to um, to give birth to if you want, okay, to keep the same analogy here. Um, so this is really about you, okay? This is about you trying to find beauty, trying to find something that you really, really, really love that just takes you to a wholly different, uh, you know, to a whole different place. Um, then we have followed upon two different cards now, okay? So these cards are very, very important. What I'm going to tell you here we have a facing of a product, a facing of the dragging, and then we have some assessment. So I feel as though over here you're going to face your partner because uh, you do believe that there is cheating. There's an awful lot of, um, there's a lot of options out there for them, I can tell you. There is a lot of uh, poisoned apples going around. There's a lot, a lot, a lot of temptation, and they're not very happy that they think that you know about this. Um, so, you know, they're quite angry at you right now now and um, so you know are they cheating or you know are they planning on cheating yes they are this is a very difficult moment you're going to have to try and assess okay this is what you're doing here here you're facing the dragon you're facing the partner you're saying what it is that you know what it is that you want what it is that you figured out that you want out of life okay what is going to be your new beginning is what you're explaining over here to your partner but I do have to say say that even though you have explained it, um, the danger is still there. The danger is still lurking. The danger is right behind this tree here. It's not menacing right now. It's not even moving, but this is your danger, okay? This is the potential danger for um, for cheating again, okay? And that danger is just going to follow all the way up to you again, and you're going to get the know, you're going to know about it quite quickly. So, this is really about trying to assess your losses, okay? It's trying to figure out what went wrong, how did it go wrong, what could I do to make it better, if I can make it better, and really you must be, you must take a stand over here, you must say what it is that you want to say, okay? The dragging representing your partner, and leave no temptation for anything, okay? So that being said, um, we're going to go down over here to the Oracle card, and the Oracle card is all about memories, it's lessons learned, it's choices made. This is, you know, memory. It is the diary that we all carry about within us, okay? We all have it. Um, and here, as we see, there's a woman here, okay? And the woman is closing her eyes as she contemplates treasured memories from the past. 
Uh, she releases to the world all the details of her thoughts and feelings, successes and failures, good times and bad. This is exactly what I said what you're doing up here, okay? It's correlating in great perfection here. And um, this is a good times, it's a bad times. It's remembering moments that, you know, just fly about um, as pages from a diary just swirl like, you know, falling leaves here. This is really a card captures tender moments and you know all of the joys that come with it so you know I hope that you enjoyed this reading I hope it gave you the answer that you wanted well not the answer that you want to but I hope it gave you the answer that you were searching for um, I do believe you did have a lot of doubts. You did know about it. Um, so I do wish you much, much courage. If you would like to have a personal reading, you'd like to have more information on your situation, please do contact me at romancefultarot at gmail.com and it will be my great pleasure to send you the information on the different types of readings that I can do for you. So that being said, I do wish you a fantastic day. Many, many blessings. Uh, please don't forget to subscribe before leaving. And we'll be seeing each other soon. Have a